A block of mass 12 kilograms is connected to a block of mass of 8 kilograms by a light inextensible string which passes over a smooth fixed pulley. The 8 kilogram block is connected to a third block of mass 5 kilo kilograms by another string as shown in the diagram. So here we've got a 12 kilogram mass passing over a light smooth pulley fixed to the 8 kilogram mass and then underneath we've got another piece of string holding the 5 kilogram. Draw a diagram to show all the forces acting on each of the three blocks, hence find the acceleration of the system and the tension in each string. So we're going to have two tensions, one here and here, that's the same. These two are the same because it's a light smooth pulley and this tension here. And because this weighs more than this, we we're going to assume that it's going to be moving in that direction. So drawing uh, force diagrams. So if we take the 12 kilogram block, we have the weight acting downwards, which is going to be 12 G newtons. That's, that's the force acting downwards and tension T1 acting upwards. That refers to that tension in that string there. And then we got acceleration going upwards here of a meters per second squared for the eight kilogram block which is this one we got the t1 t uh, tension going upwards which is the same as this one and then going downwards we've got a, a weight of 8g newtons and also we've got the tension of the string connected to the eight kilogram block and then for and the acceleration this time is going downwards because it's going like in that motion and then for the five kilogram block we've got tension t2 acting up the same as this tension here and a 5g newton force acting downwards there right and of course the acceleration is also acting downwards so we writing down equations of motion so we'll start with the 12 kilogram block. So this is moving upward. So it's going to be T1 minus 12 G newtons. Minus 12 G is equal to MA. So 12 times A, we're going to call that equation one. For the uh, eight kilogram block, we're going to have eight G plus T2. So these two here acting downwards minus t1 is equal to 8a so it's going to be these two minus this one uh, is equal to ma because the acceleration is acting downwards and then finally for the five kilogram block we're going to have 5g newtons minus t2 is equal to ma which is five times a we've got equation three right now we could make t1 and t2 the subject however if it's far easier if we just add the three equations together because when we do that t1 plus minus t1 will give nothing and then t2 plus minus t2 will give no t so we've eliminated t we'll just have an equation in a so that's going to give me 8g plus 5g minus 12g so don't forget the t1s cancel out and the t to cancel out if you add them and then we've got to do 12 plus 8 plus 5 which is going to be 25 lots of a so 8g plus 5g minus 12g just gives me 1g which is g is equal to 25a and therefore a will be equal to g over 25 meters per second squared All right so going over here so there's my acceleration here is the numerical uh, equivalent 0 0.392 meters per second squared so if we now substitute that value into equation one, so equation one was T1 minus 12G is equal to 12A. So rewriting that, we get T1 is 12G plus 12A. So that's going to be 12 times G plus 12 times G over 25. So using maybe the exact answer. And then we're going to have uh, 100, that gives me 122.304 Newtons, which is 122 Newtons. And if we substitute into 3, we're going to have 5G minus T2 is equal to 5A. T2 is going to be 5G minus 5A, which is going to give me 5G minus 5 times the acceleration, which gives me 47.0, which is 47.0 Newtons. 
Right, if we just put that all onto one force diagram, so we've got an acceleration going upwards here and an acceleration going downwards here. We've got a tension here of 47.0 newtons to 3 centimeters, and the tension here is 122 newtons. So this has been a video to show you how to find tensions in the string and an acceleration for a system of pulleys of a connected object. I hope you've understood, and I thank you very much for watching.